Hey, you guys! And how did I make? In case you don't know and you're new here, I play the sloth video and then say literally me because it's literally me. I'm Bunny. Sometimes I buy stuff, sometimes I say stuff, sometimes I do stuff. <laughs> What's up, guys? Thank you so much for clicking on today's video! Today, we are going to be roasting cider again. <laughs> If you don't know, I did a cider video a long time ago where I bought a whole bunch of their viral wide leg pants. I bought a couple body suits, I think some tank tops. I will link that video up here in case you are interested, but believe me, my experience was not positive. But here I am again, like a fool. I fell for more of the viral stories. I think they're TikToks, but I don't really do TikTok that often. And when I post on there, I'm definitely not scrolling. So I think more of these TikToks are just coming in through my Instagram. And so I'm like seeing the stories or the ads like through whatever, whatever. Anyway, recently there was like this huge, like this viral jumpsuit that Cider carries. It's like a sleeveless jumpsuit that has like fake boning on the inside here. I'll, I'll just pop a picture right here. It's like a stretchy material that has like fake seams in the middle that's supposed to cinch you in and it's wide legs and it has pockets and it's just, it's supposed to be this like universally flattering jumpsuit for everybody. I have seen a ton of ads on it. I have seen little tiny girls wear it. I have seen plus size girls wear it. I have seen mid size girls wear it. So I went ahead and bought it. <laughs> Actually, I bought two jumpsuits and the thing is, is I wanted to buy the viral one, but when I went to go buy it, it was sold out in the size that I wanted. So I went ahead and bought another one, which is very similar because it's like the same material. It's just a different style. It's long sleeves and the boning is a little bit of a different panel in it. But I bought that one first, but you're actually gonna see that one. I'm gonna try that on second. So it was a little bit of confused and there's like some over here. I bought that one first. I bought it in a medium because if you watch my last cider video, I bought everything in like a large and everything was like massively too big. So I was like, all right, let me buy this jumpsuit in a medium. So I get it and I think it fits. I think it fits and the thing is is the paneling that's supposed to be like the cincher thing it like comes up a little high over my boobs so I was like okay when I can get the viral sleeveless one I will order that in a large to hopefully like you know get fixed that situation ah, I mean did it get fixed no, we're just gonna have to find out when you see me try them on so the very first video that we're gonna see in my weird triple screen horribly lit bedroom Room scene over here. It's gonna be the gray jumpsuit. This is the viral one. I will just take it out of the package here, but you will definitely see it on me. Uh, if you are into any of the fast fashion things, which I am trying to get away from, you might have seen this one. This is just a sleeveless jumpsuit and it has like the corset center in it. I did get it in this smoky gray color. It is the typical cider fabric. But anyway, you will see all of that in the video. So let's shoot over there and you can just make fun of me all you want. I will see you back here in a minute. Okay, so. Here is the viral jumpsuit from Cider. It's all over TikTok, all over blah, blah, blah. blah. You might think it looks okay. <laughs> I have it paired here with some white wedge sandals. As you can see, the length is pretty good. I can even take off the sandals and uh, have, you know, could be a casual little sneaker look, which I love. The pants are nice and wide, and this is the typical cider kind of ribbed material. So it is very giving, very stretchy, very polyester-y, so it does not breathe very well. So just make sure you keep that in mind. I really do not like this jumpsuit and am severely disappointed in it. Yes, it has pockets, and that's probably the one saving grace of it. The thing that made this super viral is it's this loose, stretchy fabric, but it's supposed to have this boning right here to like kind of cinch in the waist. I just feel one, anybody that has boobs, it's not going to sit correctly. This is a size large. The other one that I have, I did buy in a size medium, so you'll see that. But I don't really like the boning that much in here. And again, this 
This is the problem I have with Cider's pants. If you have any sort of kitty cat area down there, these pants, I'm just, I'm just not a fan. And I guess if you keep your hands in the pockets and pull it away from your body, like you can kind of alleviate that. But that is a big problem that I have with this style of material and pant from Cider. I don't think that it pulls in, it kind of looks better on camera here. It might be the up angle or something. I don't feel in real life it looks this cinching. I feel that it is kind of makes me look boxy, like SpongeBobby. The other thing is, if you wear a bra, it you, you gotta be special. It's gotta be a special type of bra because it is kind of like cut in through the sides. All right, from the side. Okay, it's, you know, I, I don't feel like it's super flattering, but the worst part about this is the zipper ends in a seam that goes right in your ass crack. So it is very, in my opinion, not flattering to the butt. And as my husband was zippering it up, he's like, oh, I mean, I would totally not buy this again. <laughs> Pluses are, it is really comfortable. Uh, of course, this is like some super stretchy fabric. I mean, look at it. I do like the length. I like the wide leg. I like the color. The color is really, really pretty. I do not like how the boning, boning isn't underneath my boobs like it should be. And I feel like if I got an extra large, I'd be swimming in it. I do not like... The seam in the butt, which I think is a major fail. I think that's just poor craftsmanship. You wanna know the worst part about this? Like with all jumpsuits almost? You can't really pee in this. You know what I mean? This zipper goes so high up the back for me to like contort around to try and unzip it every time. Uh, forget it, like forget it. It's just... So I don't know where people are wearing these things to. I don't know if it's just for TikTok or just for photo shoots. I mean, it is, I mean, in the right angle, it's very cute, but I don't think that it's flattering on every type of body. I don't think that it's crafted well. And I mean, the only thing it's really got going for it, pockets. All right, so you see that didn't go too well for me. <laughs> I will say I'm glad I got that on a discount because I am very kind of disappointed by it. I love me a jumpsuit and I was very excited to have this like easy breezy casual one and was really disappointed. If you didn't get a good look in that video, I, I talked about how the zipper down the back is like, so, why is it sewn like this? Look, this is the butt. Like, why is it sewn like that? Like. Did I just, did I get a dud? Like, okay, so this is like the bottom of the zipper where the material is, and so it like pulls. Anyway, we're gonna move away from that one for right now. We're gonna move into the next one. The next one I bought is a black one, of course. <laughs> Spoiler alert, this one is a little bit better. Now, I did pay a little bit more for this one. The gray one, I believe I paid $14 for. I got it at a discount. This one, I think was like, 24 or $28, so I think pretty freaking pricey for a, you know, fast fashion jumpsuit that isn't like 100%, like, you know. I feel like if I would have paid like a little less than 20 for this, I'd be a little bit more happier, but this is the black one, and as you'll see in the next video, it's styled a little bit differently, but um, let's hop over there and you can check this one out. All right, this is the other jumpsuit from Cider. I will admit I like this one a little bit more. This is a black kind of long puff sleeve style. It does have a panel, which again, I think I think this line is supposed to go down here. So when I bought this in a size medium, this is the reason that I bought the other one in a large, because when I got this one, this kind of didn't fit very well. And so then I bought the other one in a large and you saw that didn't even fit. But I mean, this does fit me. I feel like it looks a lot better than the other one. I don't get as much of the pooling 
through the crotch as the other one did. This material, again, it is the ribbed stretch fabric, but it does feel a lot thicker than the other one for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, it still has the pockets. It is a low cut, which I think is it's suggestive, but like not over the top because you are covered like the whole way. It is, again, the wide leg. I have some little leopard heels on with these. I think from the side, this looks like a little bit more flattering than the other one. I don't know if it's just the extra structure because of this mid piece and the sleeves or whatnot, because it is, I think, the same material. And the back on this one is a little bit more flattering. Uh, there is, I think the seam ends right about here, but for some reason, because I think of this back panel, it's just a little bit more flattering than the other suit so i did pay more money for this one and i actually I'm like i'm not mad at this one i do think this doesn't fit right here but i think i can still get away with it i think this would be like a really cute outfit to kind of not to be morbid but i think a funeral <laughs> i think this would be a really cute outfit to wear to a funeral or if you want to go out with for drinks with your girlfriends or maybe even like a dinner or something like i think it's this particular one is very versatile and I think it's cute I think it's comfortable I don't know if you could wear it like all day because again you have to unzip it to use the restroom and that just kind of makes the usability of it not so great but I do think this one wins hand over fist against the viral no sleeves one uh I'm sweating in it right now so we're at the same poly fabric that doesn't breathe but again, I mean, I did, I paid more for this one and uh, don't know if it's worth what I paid, but I do think it's like pretty cute. I uh, can get away with this one probably a little bit more than the gray one. Actually, I can't get away with that gray one at all. So let's just forget it. But this one is definitely a contender for like a semi good purchase for me. But I still think after my experience with all of this, I'm I'm pretty oversider. So I wanted to show you guys those two jumpsuits. I will meet you back at the desk. And we're back. <laughs> guys, thank you so much for sitting through that like terrible lit blah 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 terribly lit bedroom and the weird angles and the terrible sound like I really appreciate it I am not a professional like you guys know I am a normal person over here just trying to survive but I did think that this one was like a little bit better so um I am not completely mad at this I don't know how often I will wear it but when I get to my closet clean out series here in the near future I will definitely be keeping this one I will probably be getting rid of this gray one that's all I have for you today, guys. Listen, I am going to leave the links for both of these jumpsuits in the description box. Not because I want to, but because I think that's what you're supposed to do as like a YouTube personality. I'm also gonna be leaving links to what is on my face today because I do believe that that is more important and more valuable than anything that you're ever gonna get at Cider. If you could please like this video, it really does help me out. If you could comment down below on what you thought of these fast fashion cider jumpsuits, that would be awesome. I am totally messing up my words. And if you could subscribe so you can follow all of these antics, all my antics, you would be the awesomest. I love you guys so much. I will see you on the next one. Bye.